Hey, what's going on guys? It's Jaco, and welcome back to some more Fable 3 here as our pirate little nudist man. Instead, we're going to be making some more poor decisions like this. What happens if I murder someone and then uh, run from town? I got a bounty. <laughs> Quick reminder though, if you want to see the previous episode, be sure to check it out in the description below. All right, no, I, I officially lost the police. I got away with murder. That's cool. Oh, I had a package delivery thing. Oh, okay. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Let me do that. Nice. I've been waiting for this. Thanks. Yeah, no problem. Remember, striking innocent you people is a crime. How did it know? <laughs> Come over here. Follow me, miss. Will you follow me into the water? <laughs> nope, there we go. I murdered her. <laughs> no, she's at the bottom of this lake where she'll never be found ever again. Well, her friend Sarah will be glad at least I uh, delivered the package for sure. Now I'm all the way back here. Why? Oh, I never t finished talking to Walter. Oh, this is the man's clothes I'm supposed to be wearing to disguise myself. I don't like wearing clothes, but I guess. <laughs> this guy wearing like a thong? What the hell? Where are his underpants? You sick little freak. Ah, oh, here you are. I delivered the package you wanted me to. Yep, I just did everything you asked me. Delivered the package. Nothing more, nothing more. She's now my friend. That's good. I remember doing uh, jobs back in my criminal career after I caught murdering that man in front of his kids. I don't know if I'd feel comfortable buying random pies from this naked man who's been wanted for multiple murders. My butler, my butler, he's saying I could buy a house now, earn some passive income, and it could become like a capitalist landlord. That would- Ah, oh, crap. <laughs> Sorry. They're in very, very poor condition. All right, I'm gonna buy and rent it out. Yeah. Have you given any thought to redecorating? No, I also will not be repairing it or providing any sort of actual decent functions to the home. Whoever lives there can now deal with it. All right, one more good pie and we will have enough money and coin for our mission here. I almost messed that up. All right, I'm gonna see if I can make uh, this Sarah lady my wife. See if I can get some of her money or something like that. That's all I'm really in it for. You can take your relationship to the next level and perhaps find your true love by unlocking the lover pack. Get an upgrade a bit to allow me to become lovers with people. I'll have to do that. All right, so I need to grow a beard out of thin air and then get some tattoos okay once again this pervert butler here is watching me dress and undress like normal yeah i have all these tattoos on my arm for how many people i've killed so far now that's badass yeah i love killing dwellers thanks vince this is my new dog by the way i want him in a street fight hey vince <laughs> just immediately walk up and murder him thanks for letting me in by the way jimmy show still see that thing you do you know the thing what thing? Oh, the, the thing? Okay, here, check this out. <laughs> you like the thing, huh? Yeah, get him, doggy. I'm cooking him up nice for you. The Jeffrey Dahmer special. Cooked meat. Oh, and the gate's just still open for me, even though I've just murdered like half a dozen other men right in front of him. No, no, it is me. Let me in. Open the door. Open the door. Oh, oh. Holy crap. It's committing a hate crime and act of terrorism on these guys, quite frankly. And there we go. Dog, what are you doing to that dead body right there, you little freak? Oh, it one-shots them? That would have been nice to know. I had no clue. Yeah, I'm the king of this village. <laughs> Dig spot. No, no, we're not going to make a graveyard for all these bodies, dog. <laughs> so you're really going to fight me with that cigar in his mouth? That doesn't seem very safe. That's okay. I can just throw fireballs at him endlessly, really. Ow, that's a Molotov. That's a Molotov. All right, you know what? I stole all their slow motion potions, so I'm just going to keep spamming these. <laughs> Get high off slow motion potions. It's not so weird to say. There we go. I finally got him. Take that. Spare or strike? Mm. Oh. <laughs> oh, I just stuck my sword in like his neck. Got a ton of XP for that though. Nice. All right, guys. <laughs> I'll see you later. I know I just kind of committed mass genocide on your people and burned down your village. Defeating Seika has won over many of the people he terrorized. Was that really a change of policy or just a new change of management? Because I plan on terrorizing everyone still. Right, so I can buy the family pack here and then the lover pack. And then I can have a bunch of little children that I'll never have to feed. Hopefully I can force them to get jobs. That'd be cool. There we go. I'm now becoming an even more powerful warlord. <laughs> Alright, time to go marry that Sarah woman, have some kids, and then it tell her that I murdered her friend and dumped her body in a lake afterwards. I believe that just a few days ago I was rousing you from a comfortable bed. <laughs> what the hell does that mean? <laughs> rousing me from a comfortable bed? Can I 
ransack this random house? Can I steal, can I steal anything? Doesn't look like it, unfortunately. What's up, little kid? We're supposed to do good deeds, but you never do any. Yeah, I know. Check this out. Uh, this little kid's getting pissed. <laughs> I'm perfect in his face. I did that right in front of a guard. He did not care at all. He's seen what I'm capable of. Michelle the beggar, why don't you just get a job? Come on, I could, you could literally work at the pie stand like I do. Wait, someone got me- Oh, it is Sarah! Hello, she got me a present. Thank you so much. Okay, we just had an awkward, like, slow dance in the middle of the street. Oh, now she wants me to do another stupid little courier quest for her? Oh my god. Can't we just hug it out and just call us married and you can start paying rent? <laughs> Alright, hopefully I don't have to deliver the package to the same friend. That would- that'd be awkward. Hello, miss. I'm here to, uh, deliver a package from your friend Sarah. There we go. Now she's off the cliff and dead. Now we'll never hear from her again. Hey, Sarah, I'm back. Your friend loved the package. Thank you. I really am the greatest friend. <laughs> oh, so I'm stuck at best friends now? Do I have to do another quest for her? Wait a second. Sarah's a lesbian? I didn't know that. Oh man. I've been wasting my time on her this whole time. How could I have been so stupid? I didn't know there was an info tab. We became best friends, and all that time, she never told me she was a lesbian. She wasn't interested in men. I had no idea. Oh yeah, I bet we'd. I bet you'd love to be my friend if I do shit for you. Ah uh, yes, I guess I can go fetch some crap for you. Oh, this is this is the house I bought right here. <laughs> this is quite the house. I could just sleep here. Someone lives here. You were trespassing. Are you sure you want to use this bed? Yeah, sure. I own the place. <laughs> what the hell is this tab? Unprotected sex? Am <laughs> I gonna be having sex? What the hell is this game? All right, I think I found the little key thing for Lara here. Yep, yep, found the key. Lovely. I don't know why the hell there's a random key dug up in the middle of nowhere and she needs it oh so badly for something. Wait, this woman's a lesbian too? You know what? I'm done finding a wife. I'm sick and tired of everyone just playing me like a damn fiddle. <laughs> How is she a housewife? That I'm so confused. Give me a gift right now. Oh, great. Now I'm being tasked to do more chores so I can be charitable. Now, see, I want to gain followers through fear, not actually help people now i need to put on a chicken disguise actually <laughs> this i could do this is pretty cool there we go <laughs> well, what are you what are you planning to do dressed as a chicken nothing why do you keep watching me undress sick freak what are you doing running around in circles you damn buffoon come on we got chickens to find <laughs> i can't kill chickens god damn it all right, come here. I'm your mama. I'm your mama now. Come here. This is so cool. I could have my own evil theme song and have all my chickens follow me. I can't wait till these followers are, aren't are actually chickens Terrific. and they're real people. I could have my own theme song like uh, Darth Vader in the Empire. That'd be so cool. Oh, hey, nice crate. <laughs> this guy <laughs> hates me and I see why now. Come on. <laughs> You're coming with me. Oh, sorry, I didn't actually mean to do that. I I apologize. Aw, oh, crap, I have a bounty. Come on, chickens, we gotta go. Surely they won't believe some random chicken that possesses fire magic try to light them on fire. No way the police are believing that. All right, all your chickens are back, sir. And yes, I may have the police after me, but don't worry about it. Yeah, I don't know if this woman understands, but we need these chicken for food, so we have to kill the chickens. We have to kill them all. Yes, that's a great idea. You're either with me or one of them. You're one of the chickens. Shoot her, I'll execute her myself. <laughs> Bernard's chickens are no longer a threat to anyone. You, however, are a menace to society. I now have a chicken trophy that will forever be on my wall. Nice. Uh, I guess I gotta do some community service. All right, I give up. I'm already getting 60 gold at five multiplier. That's crazy. All right, I have over 1,100 gold, so I'm going to go buy some more property, and then we'll continue helping the, the village people here. All right, a couple of these have uh, house conditions of zero, which honestly doesn't really affect me because I won't be living there. I'll just be purchasing the property and renting it out. <laughs> oh, wait, I can do the highest rent value? Holy crap! Yes, yeah, absolutely, highest rent value. I didn't know I could do that. Let's go to my other property and do the exact same thing, earn me some more money. Yeah, I'll, I'll keep the rent at normal for now because I need someone to move in, get comfortable with the location, then I can run up their rent. <laughs> All right, don't worry, sir. I'll find your lost play. Oh, what? You're sucking me into the book. <laughs> so now I have to perform a play. What is this game? I love how goofy it is. Nothing is taken seriously at all. Show Oliver that you love him and we may be able to leave this scene. All right, could I, could I be evil instead? <laughs> I can abuse him, yeah, sure. Why not? <laughs> 
drop dead. <laughs> I just threatened him. Some random woman with a goatee is threatening him. <laughs> Wait, I can keep abusing him? Okay. I doubt we'll be able to leave this book, but I'm gonna keep assaulting him. <laughs> in his face. What the hell is this game, man? Oh, and he's just dying just like that? Okay, cool. Well, one way or another, we completed the scene. <gasps> yes, I get to do a chicken scene. I'm already a chicken. Let's go. Make him laugh or declare love. Yeah, sure. I'll just declare my love for him. Yes, there we go. The first bit of love I ever make in this game is to an imaginary ghost. Complete the scene by dying in battlefield or defeating all of the aces man's- Oh yeah, I can just kill them all, yeah. I'd rather do that, I don't want to die. Oh, I just snapped his neck, that was sweet! Mm, slow motion, there we go. I slaughtered all the men. He's happy that I brought new life into his works, even though I messed everything up. The ham sandwich? That's what I was looking for all along. All right, here's your ham sandwich, you little freak. Is this meant to be a comedy? Because nobody in the crowd is laughing, nor does anyone even care. Everyone's just kind of sitting by idling. Oh, it's Tom the Crate Carrier. <laughs> there you go, made you drop a stupid crate again. All right, sir, I got all those jobs done you wanted me to do, and now I have the following of the people, even though I've committed many, many crimes. Against humanity, the hero of Brightwall. I didn't do anything good for any of these people at all. I made them listen to a shitty play and then I killed uh, their town's chickens. Alright, I guess I have to make a promise that I'll never deliver on. <laughs> yep, there's my signature. I could say Donald Duck for all I know. Alright, well, I've gotten the support of Brightwall and became their hero somehow. I'm not entirely sure how, and I think that's where we're gonna end it. I've really loved our playthrough of Fable 3 here so far, so if you guys would like to see more, a like and a comment with your feedback down below would be very much appreciated. If you are new, consider subscribing. In the meantime, check out some more of my videos here, and I'll see you guys in the next one. Peace.